and action. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Kay. And R. Coming to you live. Live. On the mountain. On the mountain in, uh, where are we? Montana. S Summers, Montana. Guys, I don't know if you can see it or not, but that's Flathead Lake behind us. We'll give you a little panoramic see view. See it, see There's, it. There's uh, fires going out here that's brought a little you can't really see the mountains haze too. In. We're like smoking. They call this uh, Montana fog, and um, you know it's uh, it smells a whole lot like Burger King. Yeah, this is like being in a being <laughs> in a giant like, giant Burger King. It is. Makes me want to kind of hold the pickles and hold the lettuce. Special order, don't upset us. All we you. ask is that you let us serve it your way. way. But we do have good news. This is just day one of our trip. Uh, I haven't been here for 28 years. Shout out to Carrie and Chris, who I came with the girls 28 years ago. And now we're back. We are back. We're back, but we're staying in this really nice place. Okay, let's give them the pan of the place here. So okay. we're going to turn around and then lo and behold, Do you right see that there. Back? Do you see that little, well, it's not little, it's pretty big. Do you see it? See it? It's like a inn. It's Where are crazy. we staying? What's it called? These people own a hotel Something bluff? and then they rent out couple of rooms in their house yeah something bluff i don't know what it's and then wait, wait, you know we're back over here to the lake can you see it but uh, this place is is quite spectacular quite here spectacular. show them the little chairs and the wine glasses um, and all the set up here I, this is when you make me spin around and i'm never good at it okay i'll just do it this way so see they have little spots that's where we're sitting having a little cocktail yeah. and then over by the, the little cabin which again if i do it this way you'll see you can see there another place anyway they have all these little spots to sit it's quite lovely but the one thing they don't have is a fence so see where you can i mean it's like falling it's off the uh <laughs> you can see they don't have... anyway he's being silly um what we're gonna say anyway we're not gonna make this a long video other than thank you to the hawks for coming right. back and going we... after keith even way out here we spent most of the day traveling so we got up at 4 30 this morning a lot of airport travel we hit the bojangles about 5 15 on the road at 5 30 and down to the airport got down there by 6 30 tsa pre is no good we flew delta out here we went from atlanta minneapolis to minnesota, minnesota and then from minnesota Mama's. to um kalispell montana, montana kalispell montana Delta, I, I tell you, I've never noticed this before. I don't know if I've lost my ass or what, but your damn seats, <laughs> they're just not comfortable anymore. Not, they weren't comfortable. Let me tell you something. They got all that padding built. When you look at the seat, it's got the dip where your butt cheeks go, and then it's got a little rise right there in the middle, and then a dip where your butt cheeks go. But the first goes. flight was good because we upgraded. Neither one of them were good. They put That's pressure right on the old tailbone. I don't need any pressure He's, on there. Now his ass hurts. Delta, if you're watching this, raise the butt cheek pads. Lower that little thing in the middle. Learn a lesson from the bike people. You don't want pressure on your coccyx. You know, it's kind of like... what? Coccyx. Is it your coccyx or your... It's your tailbone, okay? I'm telling you, you don't want pressure there. It's just like these shoes. It's got the high arch support. I don't want pressure up in my arches, okay? I mean, I want the pressure where the pressure belongs. So let's get the pressure let's back on together. the butt cheeks, Delta. All right. Ooh, it's windy. All right. Canar. Okay, day one. Canar out.